Right, so today we are setting up to do the skirting and architrave. So, this is set up at the minute. Dwarf chop saw, dwarf dust, dust extractor, takes the van, and a few more bits out. So, well, you see, you've got all the dwarf T stack boxes inside of the door, which is so easy. So, look at this box. Right, so we are just about to fit all the skirt in and architraves around this property on the extension we done in Brixham. So I'm gonna show you the processes of it all. So from the measuring, measuring out, marking out, cutting, I'm gonna show you all that right now. First and first is a tape measure. See that? So we're going to run from that point down there all the way down to this corner. So our measurement there is two, three, five, two. All right. So let's go cut it. Right, combination square. See my mark going up the wall? Fortunately, the client's painted already, it's just a bit more of a pain, but I like to go about 7mm. So you set the combination square to 7mm, run that down with your pencil, butt it up to there. So I'm trying to do this one under, it's a bit tricky. And then you can see your very angle that you need to take your measurements. So what you do, measure from the floor up to that point, which for us, two meters. So, that's what I've done a minute ago, but you measure to the internal side, two meters. And then from there, a 45 degree angle, going upwards. Like so. And all you do then is butt up the architrave to your marks on the wall. Job done. And then I'll show you how to do the right angle returns on the top. Right, I am gonna show you the fastest way to scribe a skirting board, all right? So I'll quickly show you that now, so you can use it in your own practice, in your own time, so you can push your jobs further, quicker. On the my saw, put your piece of timber, skirting board in this case, and see the angle that I've got there? So you put it on a 45 degree mitre, and all the exposed timber there that you can see. So all this, on those angles, all the way around, that's what you cut out to give you your scribe. Okay, so what we use for speed wise is a jigsaw, so I'll show you how to do that now. So, like that, 
All right, let's go try it now. So, as you can see, I'm gonna show you properly. So this side scribed, and this side scribed. So what you do, so get that end in there, yeah. And then here, Perfect. Like I said, you don't tend to usually do a double scribe, you usually do one side and then the other side is just a straight cut against the wall. But hopefully it gives you some insight, but I tend not to do it because it's a lot more faff. Right, try and do one side a lot easier, save a lot more time, get a job done quicker. 